Hey guys, Dr. Steve Hoffman back with another episode of Core Wellness TV coming to you from the farm with three R's. Release, rewire, and regenerate. That's what we do. That's what we're no more degeneration. We are all about regeneration. Grounding and growing versus going like this. Okay? I want to share with you a quick case study of a, a patient who came in with some uh, I haven't been seeing a lot of people. I've been kind of seeing people like one time a week and making checking on people's symptoms from week to week. So we've been doing a very, very um, a soft opening, I guess you would call it, uh, since the COVID thing is still happening. Uh, but anyway, this uh, gentleman came in and numbness, tingling, pain, can't sleep. Can't sleep. That's a big deal, right? Couldn't sleep. Pain down the arm. And I'm going to show you exactly what I did with him that helped it immediately go to 50% better and within uh, just about a week, 100% better sleeping through the night. But first, uh, just a couple of updates from Core Wellness Institute. Uh, we are uh, moving into an exciting new time in a new space. I know we just... When we went through this transition of uh, moving and downscaling our office about six months ago, uh, six months ago, uh, didn't work out. Seems to Rebecca and I that we have opened up a new facility, and it's beautiful, uh, and it's going to be a hub for regenerative living, both for our local community and for me to continue sharing mindset, movement, and nutrition strategies for you to stop degenerating and stop and start regenerating. Because basically the whole system right now, the way we're looking at things, we're just going into degeneration. If we can just change the environment that we immerse our bodies and ourselves in. We can immerse ourselves in a regenerative environment that makes us more resilient and powerful and strong and ability, you know, reverse our biological age. It's possible, right? It's not about chronology. It's about what you do with your body that determines your biological age. And this COVID thing, is more dangerous the more you are biologically aged. So we're going to reverse biological aging. We are going to share the message of regenerative agriculture. That will be a piece of it. And of course, regenerative living in general. Like I said, stop degenerating, start regenerating, ground and grow. So more to come on that. I'll be sharing some uh, a new video from the new space very, very soon. We are doing some little bit of construction in there right now, but just want to give you a heads up on that to look out for more regenerative living solutions from Core Wellness Institute. My patient who came in three years ago, four years ago, he had a neck surgery where he had just, you know, excruciating pain down his other arm and uh, ended up having a surgery where they went in and basically uh, C6, C7, I believe, they went in and through the front and they kind of jacked up to put a little, I, I don't remember what the surgery was exactly uh, and he couldn't describe it to me. So he said they went in there and jacked up the area between the vertebrae. So there was more space for the nerve to move down the arm. After the surgery, completely pain-free, no problems whatsoever. Um, but what happened after that was he started developing uh, the inability to hold down food. So for the last three years, he's been carrying around a cup, and every time he eats something, he throws up. Asks the surgeon, what is this? And he said, that's one of the side effects of the surgery, is that you possibly could throw up your food for the rest of your life. I'm like, wow. And then I got to thinking, you know, when you start working in the cervical area, there's C3, 4, 5 keeps the diaphragm alive. Okay. And when you're in there and you're cutting and going through, 
it's possible that you can damage some of that nerve supply to the diaphragm. So my first thing was, of course, on, of course, now he's talking about the other side, right? But we were able to teach him how to, well, first of all, I said, take a breath. And he was breathing like this. And he's very, I'll call him very uptight, ribs very flared. And he took his breaths were like this. I'm like, hey, look, we've got to make space in these vertebrae, right? The surgeon made space surgically over here a few years ago. What we're going to do is we're going to teach you how to make that space from within. And we taught him, number one, okay, this is not a way to breathe or else every time you take a breath, you're pinching down the amount of space there is for that nerve to come out. So the first thing is I said, let's just, I put my hands around his ribs and I said, let's just exhale. Oh, do you feel that come down? Did you feel how that released a lot of that tension from that area? And he said immediately, oh, I'm, I'm starting to feel my hands again. So without ever touching him, doing an adjustment, doing a manual manipulation of muscle or tissue, just by showing him how he can create, see what I just did there? Stress up tight. I just made space. He just made space. And now, the first night, he's halfway better. Within a week of teaching him more, basically, uh, strategies to reverse cross posture syndrome which is the stress induced muscle imbalance of tension we showed him how to do basic exercises to release all that stuff and now he's sleeping through the night no pain no problems still so anytime he does feel like something's coming up he just goes oh and it goes away now is this every single person every single time no but it shows us that just by getting into the environment of tension and mindset stress and uh, just you get into once you're in a pattern you're in a pattern right you have to break it you have to release it rewire it and then your body has a chance to regenerate and that's what we did so i'm just going to share that one basic thing with you of course there's multiple things we did but breath in breathe out how low can your ribs go Every time your ribs get lower, there's less tension through your neck and shoulders. By the way, this can help with TMJ. It can help with stress and tension in these muscles here. It can help with stress headaches because trigger points in these upper trapezius muscles send pain up around the base of the uh, skull, around the temples, and behind the eyes. So you can help with stress headaches. You can help with TMJ. You can help with, uh, obviously, numbness and tingling down the arm. Fundamentals, guys. Let's master the basics. Let's get our rib cage in this lowest expiratory position. Okay? And of course, we had him lay over a foam roll, right? Lay backwards over a foam roll, a foam roll with it up. And he's laid back over it. Let's open up the front and let's train everything down and we can get rid of symptoms. Side benefit of this, up chucking, diminished by half, 50% reduction. He doesn't have to, he's like, what? I asked him after about a week, so how is it, how's the nausea and vomiting going? He said, I, you know what? I haven't even thought about it. And you know what? He doesn't carry his cup around with him everywhere he goes. Why? Because when you, eat something that goes down your esophagus your diaphragm which is the operative muscle here when you lower it and activate it properly the diaphragm is responsible for making that tight connection so the stuff in your stomach doesn't come back up through it's called a hiatal hernia he's dealing with a functional hiatal hernia that's what i think but just by engaging and learning how to use his diaphragm again he is now able to keep the contents of his stomach from coming back up into his mouth every day. Wow. So this was an awesome case study. I just wanted to share that with you, but my whole point is release, rewire your new movement programs so your body can actually regenerate and do what it's supposed to do so you can live with peace physiology versus stress physiology. Peace physiology?
stress physiology. Which one do you want? <laughs> Guys, last thing before I go is this. Uh, I know during this COVID epidemic, I put everything that I have, uh, an all access pass into the Core Wellness Institute where all my training that I've done over the last 10 years plus, I did it all for a pay what you can. I think it's like a $650 option all the way down to 49. So that's going away very, very soon. If that interests you, you can learn more at the description. If you're watching this on YouTube or if you're watching this on the blog, it will be somewhere on this page. So you can check that out. And if you want to have a step-by-step -step comprehensive program to release, rewire, and regenerate, love to have you inside so again that is going away very very soon it is may and everything's going to change soon so uh, again look for a new video from the new office the new studio i don't even know what it's called it's kind of a unique environment so excited to show it to you but guys keep living regeneratively stop the degeneration start grounding growing and live with peace physiology okay bye-bye